or anyone in the congressional no. delegation? No. Why, why did you take in this announcement today? After talking to my family over the course of the summer, uh, I thought the time was good now to tell the Rhode Islanders you're going to see Link Chafee devoting all his time and energy to the issues you care about. Governor, what would you like to do? You say you don't have anything lined up. What would you like to do? And the, you went to Brown after the last, after the Senate. The it's a year and a half away. What I'd like to do is do the job well for the next year and a half. And you that, that's. For other Democrats, perhaps? Although you won't be running yourself? We'll see. Oh, thank you. We'll see. When did we'll you see. tell your state? I, again, I, I can't emphasize enough that the challenges we have in the state, we all know, are are many, and I want to put all my time and energy into those challenges. Governor, do you think you would have won if you had run again? I do. I do. I've always been competitive in my races. You know my history. Uh, I've never had an easy race running for council, running for mayor, running for senator. I've never had an easy one. So, Governor, if you, if you feel as you said you could have won, then why not, instead of just devoting the next year and a half, be able to devote the next five and a half years to doing what you've done? You know what it takes to run for office. It's hugely time consuming. And I want to, again, put my time and energy to where Rhode Islanders are paying their hard earned tax dollars for it to be spent on their issues. Is you that it for you now? I mean, after this, no more seeking any, office, any political office? Or would you seek an appointment to something? There's, no, no. I expect to be here for the next year and a half doing, as I said, making sure that the issues that I. Whether it's RIPTO or DMV or higher ed, no tuition freeze or higher ed. That's just, I don't want that just to be one year. I want that to be every year. So, driving down the costs of getting a higher education for Rhode Islanders. So, so after that year and a half is over, are you done with political campaigns forever? Who knows? Who knows? We'll see what comes down. Was being fight. governor more difficult than you anticipated, Steve? Yes, I will say, Ian. Uh, as I, I've been around a long time, Thanks, and I. I I knew the power of the General Assembly, that by Constitution here and around, that's no surprise. But it's, it, I call it irrational negativity. It's been a worse than I expected.